The Style Picker allows you to copy style attributes from an object or text and quickly apply them to other objects or text. You can access the Style Picker tool by holding the left mouse button on the Color Picker tool and releasing the mouse button over the Style Picker. Currently, we can see that the pipette icon is unloaded. If I click an object, the icon changes to a loaded pipette and now I have the option to unload it on the context toolbar. This lets me know that the picker is now loaded with attributes from that object. I can click another object to apply the same attributes. Notice that the style picker continues to hold the first object's attributes, so they can be applied to other items within the document. If I want to copy different style attributes, I can click unload on the context toolbar to reset the picker. I can be selective with the style attributes that I want to copy. Here I have three circles and I'd like to make them the same opacity without changing the fill colours. Along the context toolbar, you can see a range of attributes that will currently be copied. I can toggle the fill off from here. Now when I load the style picker, it will just copy the selected attributes from the first circle and apply them to the other two circles. I can also pre-select an object or several objects and then nominate an object with the attributes that I want to copy across. I can use V to switch to the Move tool and click drag to select these four squares and then change back to the Style Picker. If it is still loaded from before, I'll unload it and set which attributes I want to copy. In this case, I only want to copy the stroke settings and layer effects. Then I can click an object with the attributes that I want copying and it is replicated across the selected objects. The Style Picker can be used to replicate text formats too. I'll quickly unload the Style Picker using Escape and change the settings to make sure that character and paragraph settings are selected. I want to keep the text in my design consistent, so I'll sample this text by the squares. I can apply the style to individual words by single clicking on them, or I can click drag to change a range of text. I can also click on the text frame to paste the format across all the text within that text frame. There are a few keyboard modifiers that you can use to help speed up your workflow. If I hold Option on Mac or Alt on Windows and tap on a new object, it will overwrite the sample stored in the style picker. And holding Command on Mac or Control on Windows will apply the loaded style to the whole text frame when I click on a single word. Finally, I'll just show you another useful tip. If you have the style picker loaded, you can drag a selection around an object that you wish to style. And if you start click dragging and then hold Control on Mac or right mouse button on Windows, it will apply the style to objects that are only partially covered by the selection. So that was a quick look at the Style Picker's functionality and some helpful shortcuts that you'll hopefully find useful. Thanks for watching.